could change if the young people come together and put their guns down um, and, and live and not die. Well, over in Decatur, kids and adults came together to march against violence. Saturday was the second annual Stop the Violence Youth Peace March. And WCIA 3's Bradley Swank had the opportunity to attend, and he says they were looking to also achieve victory over violence. Take a look at how they did it. No violence! Don't shoot! Hundreds of people came together in Decatur with one goal in mind, to stop gun violence. Stop this is what our ancestor did. We marched for uh, for a change, and the change I'm marching for is is a different change. It's the uh, the violence, the gun violence, uh, in our community. The Shamila Outreach Center, whose goal is to keep kids off the streets, partnered with city leaders and community groups to teach the youth and to be an example. I've seen a lot of change uh, from their grades, uh, from their attitudes, from just being respectful. Um, one of the things I teach the youth is they have to respect themselves. They can't give respect if they don't know how to respect themselves. So that's one of the things we teach the youth to respect themselves. Samuel Sanders, the founder of the Shamila Outreach Center, says he is finding creative ways to help keep them out of trouble. One of the things I do with the youth, if they curse, they have to give me 25 push-ups. And a lot of them say, no, I'm not going to give it to you. I said, well, you know what, I'll call your parents. Oh, no, 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 I'll, I'll give it to you. So He believes his program is working, but says there's still work to be done. Reporting in Decatur, Bradley Swain, WCI, through your local news leader. Let's figure out what we can do to make Decatur safer. Alrighty, again, that was Bradley Swank reporting. And the organizations are hoping to plan a community prayer walk soon, so we're going to release those details once they're announced. But for more information on the Sanders Group, all you have to do is head over to our website. You'll find that at WCIA.com.